Hey, it's Ubu, and today we're playing a game called Stay Still. It's the demo. Um, I haven't seen a release date for it. It says quarter one of this year. Uh, it's The demo's free on Steam, and I thought it looked pretty cool, so let's check it out. Stay Still is hard. Patience through investigation and good strategy are your best friends. The game has an auto mate saving system based on axe each time you reach a new checkpoint will auto save you cannot manually save the game manually save the game okay wow that's loud in my headphones at least ooh press tab to view your current task examine the house make sure you check it closely should check out my surroundings. It's E to interact, right? <laughs> I should look up the controls for these games before I play them. I'm just all... Okay, it's click. A very old newspaper that seems to have been published a long time ago. I cannot tell what it is about because the text is blurred. Well, that's not helpful. books. Who's reading nowadays? <laughs> uh, I assume lots of people. Wow, it's dark. Don't seem to have a flashlight. Is there a sprint? Oh, shoot, man. Hello? This looks great. He's missing three fuses. Got to find them all. Objective updated. Find the fuses to turn on the electricity. I think I've seen a couple of fuses around here. It's weird that I like... Okay, C to crouch. Okay. What is this? Can I have this? Oh, I have to I had to crouch to pick it up. Okay, that's kind of weird. Huh. All right, there's another one back here. Okay. Can I can I pick it up? <laughs> okay. Well, that was finicky. Cool. That's a big power strip. Surprised I found two already, to be honest. Drawers? No? Okay. Smelly clothes. <laughs> An old radio, I don't think it still works, but who cares anyway? That's a great point. An old fuse, let's see. Ah, okay. Alright. Let's go plug it back up. Get this stuff going. Okay. Turn on the electricity. Okay. I put the fuses in there. Hmm. Is there like a... Uh, there's a switch over here. Go to sleep. I'll go to sleep. I'm a bit tired. I'll clean it afterwards. Hmm. What? <laughs> I 
Interesting. I'm tired. I'll go take a short nap. Hmm. Wow. Intense napping music. <laughs> Must, must be a, must be a comfy bed. Just to lay back like that. I can't sleep on my back. It just it doesn't work. Hmm. Oh, spooky TV. Examine the house. Make sure you interact with everything. Something's not right. Never mind. I might be delusional. Hmm. No, I, I think you're right. Some, I, you're on to something. Something's not right. I didn't turn this on. The television. This television has interference, but I can't turn it off. Yeah, okay, that's weird. What? Wow. January. I think 12 a.m. Lich. I, I don't know how to say any of this. I think it's Vietnamese or something. January 7th, 2012. Uh, 2012. <laughs> am I right? <laughs> Interact with everything. Oh, these books again. I still wonder who reads nowadays. <laughs> That's funny. C2 Crouch. What? For what? Oh. Yes! <laughs> Flashlight. Press F to use. Yeah, it seems like a decent flashlight. It's kind of... not aligned with how quickly I move the camera, but that's fine. Just a newspaper advertisement for kitchen utensils. Okay. On August 20th, 2008, a teacher committed suicide in the toilet of a high school. The police are still investigating the cause of the incident. That's sad. Hmm. All right. I, I like how they put... I guess because the lights are on, I can see that now. Or something like that. I also like how they made like a different uh, line of dialogue for looking at the books again. That's pretty funny. Ooh. Oh. What? <laughs> Oh, the TV went off. Wow. I'm, I'm pretty freaked out, actually, because it's such a small area. And I have the, my headphones, like, way up. No gas and nothing to cook, like always. Damn. Maybe if you bought less power strips that you don't use, then you might have a little extra money. Hmm. Examine the house. Okay. Still our objective. A bag of stinking garbage. I'll throw it out later. Ew. Throw it out now. <laughs> it's a phone. So all the doors are locked. And I can't quite figure out what I'm supposed to do. It's had to examine everything. I... Doing a poor job at that. <laughs> I'm trying. The picture frame is tilted at an angle. It looks like it's about to fall. Okay. Okay, that's cool. 
Backpack. Backpack, backpack. Ooh, that's a cool picture. It's got like a giant pig on it. Alright, let's check over here again. January 7th. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Jesus. Hello? Alright, we're back. Had to do something real quick, sorry. But someone was just banging on the damn door and damn... Creepy footsteps. Maybe I should check this door. It's pretty spooky. It's got good sound. Good sound design. But the game's really loud in my headphones, so... <laughs> it's immersive. Oop, something really bright and glowy over here. You have three room keys. Looks like this is the back door keys. Okay. Alright. Is this the back door? Maybe this is the, okay. Well, it opened, so. <laughs> oh, man. This flashlight is not great, actually. <laughs> the more I use it, the less I like it. Hello? To squeeze through, move towards the gap. Okay. Ah. Uh, I'm trying. Wow, that's awkward. Okay. Squeezing through, it's like Resident Evil 7. Or whatever. <laughs> Just didn't, a bunch of bugs didn't follow me, so that was pretty great. If something chases me and I have to squeeze through that, I'm gonna, I'm gonna mess it up. <laughs> I'm just saying. Close. Hmm. Another door. Two doors, actually. Okay. Break, dude. Does some music have to do that to me? Oh, fuck. Yeah, it was. It's like a bunch of blood. You have a... You have a room door key. It belongs to some door in the house. God. Oh, nope. God. Go away. <laughs> I was like standing on the toilet. <laughs> that was intense. Oh, you know, I already said it, so. Watch your mouth. I can't see anything in this game. It's, it's kind of cool, but dang. These wooden planks are blocking the closet door. A diary. A girl used to live here. She men She's mentioning that she broke up with her boyfriend. Very interesting, right? Not really, to be honest. At it's actually one of the most least interesting things I've ever heard. I'm sorry, but... <laughs> hey, this person you've never met broke up. Their boyfriend. Pretty cool, huh? So I got another key. Does it go here? Nope. Okay. Okay. 
So you have to click on the gap and then press W. I know it told me that, but... I just, I don't know. I'm good at making really easy things, like difficult. <laughs> just... Uh, oh well. <laughs> oh, jeez. Am I being chased? I'm freaking out. <laughs> they got me. <laughs> okay, another door. Uh, I guess it's this one over here. May I interact with the door, please? Find keys to unlock the main door. Okay, I guess I need to get the hell out. <laughs> yeah. So was that the main door? Jeez, Louise. Oh. Oh my gosh. Dude, I just that gave me goosebumps. Stop looking at me. Go away. Uh, don't laugh at me. Okay. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, dude, that gave me goosebumps. Like that, just turn around and someone peeking out like that. Mm -mm -mm. No bueno. So now we have to go follow her. Yes. Okay. Ooh. So this is locked. Okay. You have a closet key. Okay, let's look at this first. It's a nice picture. Talismans, I assume. And maybe those are her remains. Hmm. Maybe the teacher they were talking about in the newspaper? They have a crowbar. I used this to break the wood. Okay, we're going back. Great. Squeezy, squeezy, squeezy. Like, squeeze me. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> Creepy ghost person. No bueno. I don't know why I keep saying that, but. Oh, jeez. You have the main door key. It belonged to the main door in the house. What are these? Uh, more books. Who even reads? <laughs> Oh! Hey. That could have killed me. Need to get a house inspector or whatever. <laughs> See if we get the heck out of here. Is this the main door? Let's go. Let's get out of here. Hey. Nam escaped from the house, but he find himself lost in a school from the moment he walks through the door, and he know he have to get out of the school because something is hunting him. Hmm. I think the developer, and I don't mean to assume, maybe um, Vietnamese, I believe this is what the game is based on, obviously, it's some sort of... Um, folklore uh, thing of that nature, of the Vietnamese uh, origin. I should have read the description to be more specific.
because the game is called Stay Still, um, and then there's a, a subtitle under it, which I forgot, <laughs> but it's on the Steam page uh, that you can you can check it out. So far, for a demo, this is pretty solid. It was about three gigs. So not too big. <clears throat> so now I'm in a school. Okay, we'll keep going. Hello? It's a derelict school, apparently. They're elite. <laughs> Whoa, Jesus, loud. Uh, more books, ew. <laughs> The game told me to examine a lot of things, so I'm just being thorough. Don't want to miss anything. In a bathroom. And a weird cubby at the end of the stalls. At least their stalls go all the way to the floor. That's that's great. Or the doors. <clears throat> that's one thing people like to that aren't from the U.S. talk about bathroom stalls. Is they're like, how come yours aren't private? I'm like, I have no idea. The excuse is to say, well, if someone has a medical emergency, you know, you can get them out. I'm like, well, you can just kick the freaking door down. I don't know. I don't know why I'm talking about bathroom stalls, but that's where we're at. While we explore this spooky school. That's locked. <clears throat> hmm. Okay. That's locked, too. Okay, I didn't see anything in there that seemed important, but... All these look locked. Dead end. Could I just have a lantern? I think that'd be a better source of light than this thing. Oh, jeez. Hello? Hmm. locked. Okay, this is a large room. Jeez. <laughs> Seems like the bottom the bottom ones are like always locked. Oh, here we go. Got a locker key. It belongs somewhere nearby. Locker. Alright. Sweet. Let's go find a locker. This looks like a locker. Okay, that's locked. Alright, let's go find that locker. Let's check these out. Nope. Okay. Maybe it's this. Aha. You got the main door key. It should work on a door nearby. Okay.
All right, let's <laughs> let's see if we can get out of here. I'm just gonna close that. <laughs> All right. Oh. Wow. This is a playable teaser of Stay Still. If you enjoyed the experience, you can buy the full game from Steam. Galactic Crows. Yeah, that's the publisher. Okay, let's go back to the main menu. All right. Well, my final thoughts. I thought it was pretty good for a demo. Um, it was doing the key hunt kind of thing and sort of like um, event locking you. Like you had to do a certain amount of these things to, to progress. But overall, I thought the pacing was pretty decent, even though, you know, that's sort of a typical way to do games, especially in a demo. Uh, I don't have any complaints, necessarily. I got a little, like, confused on what to do towards the beginning. Um, but, like, you know, that's just probably user error. <laughs> um, yeah. Well, I appreciate y'all watching. Uh, sort of my goal with this channel is just to um, create something for myself and... I've focused on horror games because I think it's a good medium to just um, experience people's creativity um, in, a, in an interesting way. You know, there's there's all kinds of ways to experience uh, people's art and and what they what they want to share with the world. And I think horror is really interesting because it's it's such a it's almost niche in a way. But um, there's like archetypes like analog and the unknown kind of thing, like monsters chasing you, but through those archetypes to see how people are able to create experiences like this, I think is really fascinating. Um, so, I hope you liked it. Comment down below, share it with your friends, and I'll see you in the next one.